Hi, this is Kathy Payne with a Feldenkrais tip this time. For those of you who have discomfort or pain in your spine, especially the middle or upper back, um, turning, moving, sitting too long at the computer, this is a way to release that and give you a little bit more mobility. Um, it requires a fairly firm surface and if you need something to put under your head then get yourself a, a pillow or a folded up towel or something like that. So here we go. First thing is to lie on your side. You pick which side. Okay. And organize yourself so that your knees are directly in front of your hip joints about 90 degrees here, 90 degrees here, and your arms are out in front of you, palms together. So this is the restriction. You're going to keep your elbows straight and your palms together. Okay, the reference movement here is put your hand on your forehead, okay, gently, so you're not hurting your neck, and you're just going to open your elbow and roll and just roll as far as you go easily. Not as far as you go necessarily, but as far as you go easily and comfortably. Okay? Okay, and just notice what you're looking at. Okay, and bring your arms back. Now, relax your legs, relax your spine, and begin to slide your right knee a little forward and a little backward. Keeping your arms long and your elbows straight so your shoulders are not moving. Just your pelvis is rolling. You notice your the right hip joint here because it's the one on top is moving forward and backward and the knee is sliding forward and backward. You might make a bigger movement than I'm making or even a smaller movement. It doesn't matter. Okay, and then rest. And now make a very small movement of rolling your head. Leave it heavy on the floor or on the pillow. And just roll it a little bit. And then roll them together, your pelvis and your head. Easily. And then if you can manage it, roll them in opposite directions. So when I look up, my knee goes forward, and when I look down, my knee goes back. Notice how small the movement is that I'm doing. And you can do it slowly, and you can relax. Okay, for the purposes of the video, I've sped this up a little bit. So take your time and breathe with it. And then pause. So let yourself sink into the floor. Put your hand on your forehead again. And now let's just see where we go. Good. I'm not making this up. Good. Now you might notice that not only is my head rolling farther, but my pelvis is starting to move. Yeah. Okay. So. There you have it. What did I do with my glasses? Ah, there we go. And then what I suggest is, after you do this on one side, stand up, move around, walk a little bit, sit, and notice the difference in the two sides of your back. Try turning to one side and then turning to the other side, see what the difference is. And then if you feel a desire, if you feel a change, do it on the other side. You know what to do now. Okay. If you'd like to learn more about the Feldenkrais Method and you live in Connecticut, I would be happy to talk to you or set up an appointment. Um, you can send me a message through email, go to my website, or give me a phone call. If you're not in my area, you can find a Feldenkrais practitioner by going to the Feldenkrais Guild website. There's probably a practitioner somewhere close to you. Okay, that's it for today. Thanks a lot. I'll see you next time. Bye.